Hi everyone, in this video we are going to play CSS Diner game. The purpose of the game is to practice our CSS selectors and SEDO element skills. There are 32 levels and now we are in level 1. So the object is to select the elements. It writes select the plates here. We can see in HTML Weaver section there are two plates so we will select these two plates how to do that just write the name of the element and level 2 select the bento boxes okay just write bento and it will select all the bentos now select the fancy plate what is this fancy plate? This plate has an ID name fancy. So we will use ID selector. ID fancy. And it will select the elements with ID fancy. Select the apple on the plate. Okay, we will use a descendant selector. First, we will write plate. So space so we say something in plate what is this apple so we will say select the apple inside of the plate select the pickle on the fancy plate okay first we select fancy and inside of it space inside of it we select pickle select the small apples so small apples has a class name small so we just use a dot and small we use class selector select the small orange there are three orange here two of them are small so if I write orange here it will select all the orange but in, if I write class uh, small it will select all the small orange and also small apple so I want I want this um, it will select class name small but also only oranges how to do that we we write the name of the element we want to select and also no space just write continue orange and dot class small like this way select the small oranges in the bantos now same again inside of a bento select the small class elements but also they have to be uh, orange bento uh, space orange with class small select all the plates and bentos so we select plate and then select bento okay select all the things so we use universal selector this one it will select everything select everything on a plate so we use plate and inside of the plate everything select every apple next that's next to a plate so we will use sibling selector how to do that we want the uh, apples next to the next to a plate this one and this one not these apples so we first write plate and after we use plus symbol and we say apple so it will select apple next to a plate select the pickles beside the bento okay similar to 
previous one, but this time not only one next to bento, not only one, but all the pickles after uh, this bento, but not inside of another element, only pickles here. So sibling to a bento. How to do that? We write bento and sibling selector and we write pickle. Now select the apple directly on a plate. So this plate is empty. This apple is not in a plate. This plate, this apple in a plate, and it's child of this plate. But this plate, uh, this apple also in this plate, but it's not the child of the uh, plate. It's, uh, it's bento is the child of the plate and apple is the child of the banter so we don't want to select this one we want to select this one directly ch ch uh, child of the plate how to do that we write plate and say this symbol and it will say child of a plate say apple now select the top orange what is this uh, orange if you check the HTML section, we see this plate has three orange and this one is the first one. So we will use first child selector. I write first child. But if I write first child, it will select also this one because this one also the first child of the table. So I write orange it must be uh, orange and first child select the apple and the pickle on the plates okay this time we will use only child so the selector and how to do that we say it's in a plate and it's a it has to be an only child so not this one but not this one select the small apple and the pickle so how to do that we use the last child this pickle is the last child of the table and this small apple is the last child also the first and only child of this fancy table so I use last child but if I select if I say only last child see it will select also this last child of this plate and I don't want this so how to how to not select this orange but this pickle and this pickle. This pickle and this uh, apple is close class name small, but this uh, this one er, orange is a normal. So if I say select something with class name small, but the last child. That's it. Now select the third plate. How to select third plate? We use and child and child selector and child which one third so third plate and we now select the first bento but it says do this with the uh, and last child selector so and last child and last child so I don't write anything before the last child, so this will select everything. Uh, uh, last child of the table, it will select. Which one? This is the last child of the table. This is the second from last and third. This bento third from last. But, but 
it will also select this one because this one also third from last in this place this orange so I don't want to select this one I will write it must be a bento and last child uh, third third last child select the first apple so I want to select the first one this apple and not the first orange so it must be it must be an apple and first of type select all even places and use end of type selector if I write here even it will select second fourth sixth this way if I write here odd select first third fifth so I will write even and it will select second fourth sixth and goes on select every second plate but starting from the third so how to do that end of type again but this time I will write not even I will write to n it means same uh, select every second plate but this will start from the first one so this will start this will select this one this plate but I don't want this I want it will start from the third so I say plus third it will start from here and it will select every second okay select the apple on the middle plate so this apple not this pickle and not this apple so I will use only type only of type only of type so if I write only of type it will select also this pickle but I don't want this so I say apple and only of type select the last apple and orange so this orange is the last of the type and this pickle also last of the type and this apple also last of the type but I want to select this orange and this apple not this uh, pickle so we say last of type but not all of them I don't want to select the pickle so what's the difference between the pickle and the orange and uh, uh, apple and orange orange and apple are a uh, close class name small but pickle not so I will use I will select something with class name small and also last of type select the empty bentons we will select bento but it has to be empty this way select the big apples so we will use apple but not small because because this apples has no ID or class uh, but this apple is a class name small if this apple has a class name big we can use apple class name big but they don't have so we will use we will think reverse we will use not pseudo class we will say i will select apple but not class name small so they will select all the apples except class name small one select the items for someone so these items has four um, attributes see atom ls clara so we want to we want to select them this two this bento and this pickle not have a four uh, attribute not have any attribute so i will say select all the elements has four attribute 
select the plates for someone okay we need to select these two plates but not this bento this bento also has a uh, four attribute but we don't want to select this we want to select the, uh, these two what is the difference this has a bento these two has um, a plate so I say it must be a plate and has a four attribute select uh, Vitalis meal so we will select only Vitalis how to do that attribute value selector we will use so select items has four attribute and the value of the attribute is Vitaly so it will select only Vitaly now select the items for names that start with SA so Sam and Sarah we will select not Mary because these two start with S and A how to do that we use they have four attributes and we use this symbol equal you write the starting letters and close with this symbol we select the items value which start with S and A now select the items for names that end with a T O. So in this in this uh, example, this one Hayato and Mina Minato. We will select this two, not this one. For the for to do that, we use attribute selector for, and we use dollar sign, and after that equals. So and with the selector last last letters of the value utter and okay select the meals for names that contain obb okay for star and equals value so we will select an attribute and the value of this attribute uh, contains these two these two letters and finished we finished the game I think this is a good game for practice the selectors so I recommend you to play thank you for watching